the Princess of the Stars on its way to the bottom of the sea. It capsized during Typhoon Fengshan. An unknown number of passengers are believed to be trapped on board. Coast Guard divers have tapped on the hull but heard no reply from inside. At the offices of the ship's owners, Sulpicio Line, distraught friends and families of those on board clamour for news. They said the ship can handle it. They said the captain can handle it. Where is it now? It's on TV, showing what remained of their useless ship. Remember that. Sulpicio Line says compensation will be offered to the families of the passengers. Reports are also trickling through of survivors making it to a nearby small island. Uh, as per a Coast Guard report, as per the Coast Guard report, there have been sightings of many survivors on Crista de Gallo Island. The Coast Guard vessel is on its way there to pick them up. Also, there are four survivors whose names have been forwarded to us. But the Coast Guard says dead bodies are also drifting onto the beach. We heard that there are already cadavers uh, floating on the area, as reported by the local residents, and the boat already capsized. Typhoon Feng Shen came ashore in the Philippines on Friday, packing wind gusts of almost 200 kilometers per hour, whipping up big seas. Dozens of people have lost their lives on land, but despite this, the Princess of the Stars set sail. At 23,000 tons, the ship was considered large enough under Philippines maritime regulations to pass by the edge of the typhoon. As the agonizing wait for news of survivors continues, Philippines President Gloria Arroyo is calling for those regulations to be reviewed. Paul Allen, Al Jazeera.